Okay, folks, what I have here for today is a clock by Sly. Uh, this clock was done in the early American style. As you can see, it does have a closed door, meaning that there isn't any glass in the door like you normally see on a more modern clock, so that gives it that nice antique early American style that you get, and yet you're getting a new modern clock. Um, case is in very nice condition. up the side of the case here on this side. Nice as I say early American panels on the side here that do come out to get to the movement. Nice florets up in the uh, top of the pediment. side of the case. And one little mark there. And it's got a little dust on it too. But yeah, you know, I mean a little mark right there on the edge. These are the white shells. They're done in a in a brush brass. Um, they're in they're in good shape. You know they have some imperfections, but you know you're not going to see them. They're not meant to be seen. So you know, Sly didn't put a lot of work into them to begin with. Um, nice pendulum on a stick, done in the early American style. This is a pull chain clock. It does have an automatic night shut off. It's tucked up underneath here. There's a rod that you pull down. So that is one feature of this clock, that it does have that automatic night shut off, so it'll turn off at uh, quarter of ten at night and turn back on at about seven o'clock in the morning. Um, has a nice working lunar calendar here with some very nice coloring, nice moons, nice country scene there. Looks like probably an English cottage. So this is a working lunar calendar. Um, nice painted flowers on the dial here. And this is all painted. This is a Westminster only clock. So it only does Westminster on the quarters and strikes on the hour. You have the option here of silencing the clock. The silent lever will silent the entire clock. Um, as long as these clocks in the background stop, you hear the chimes. Very nice chime rods they put in this. I don't know whether you can see it or not, but they've actually put glass in this to make it kind of look antique. It's got a little bit of the ripples in it that you'd normally, excuse me, see in an old glass. Um, you know, it's got a few um, dots and stuff in it for imperfections to really make it look like this is an antique clock. So, um, again, I don't know if you can see them in the video, but. You know, there's nothing, you know, jump out in your face about, but it, it is kind of a nice touch they did to put a, an old style glass in it. This is a big clock. It is 90 inches tall, so make sure you got height for it. And there you have it. Oh, if you want any further information on it, 
Uh, of course, you're looking at it on the website, but you can give me a direct call, uh, 207-412-0189. Thank you. My name's Dave.